And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It's Ternana, and they take on Barry. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Sebastiano Esposito. Now Puccino. Good play it in. It should be. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Now back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Andrea Favilli. They've regained possession. Superb block. And a textbook interception. Agazzi. He has teammates around him. Firing it in. Well, they might be onto something. A oh, tremendous block. Agazzi. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. That's all they can conjure for now. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Botta. Not a bad pass it was. Agazzi. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. Ruben Botta. He's protecting it effectively. Maiello. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Plenty of support here. And the referee says corner kick. <laughs> 
taken short. And he takes on the shot. Superb block. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Top class defending. Now can they counter clinically? Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Is it going to be? And a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, it's been an incredible performance from him. Clearly the difference between the two sides. Obviously the goals, but his movement too. He's causing the back line all sorts of headaches. He'll no doubt be desperate to grab the hat-trick now. And now they get the ball rolling. Now Puccino, could play it in, it should be, there it is, the opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. And teammates around him, fractionally offside. So making the substitution now. Diakite. Good technique displayed. It is to be a throw-in. And time for the change now. He has time to play it over. Not a good pass. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Raffaele Puccino. And just failing to bend the run enough. And the flag has been raised. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Favili. I must say this looks promising, but the danger averted for now. So a half an hour remaining. Well, that pass easy on the eye. In it goes! That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high.
Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Francesco Vicari. Raffaele Puccino. Chance to cross. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. We saw the situation developing. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Andrea Favilli, determined defending. Well, approaching full time, and this is wearing the look of Mission Impossible for the home side, Stuart. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. Now, options are plenty. And let's give credit to the defending. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Poor pass. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. And they will make the change now. Martella. Can he play it in? Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. And showing fine vision. It might be. And there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, that is how to play advantage. Defendi. Perfect tackle. Plenty of support here. It's looking promising. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. 
not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.